with our sound combination. Sound combinations are two letters that make one sound. Two letters that make one sound. T H, get ready, go. T H B T H B H U S H U C H T C H T W H whistle whoop W H whistle whoop E A the dolphin. Okay, so today while we're reading our story, B and the missing bear. There is a reading strategy that we're going to be using. The reading strategy we're going to be using is called chunk, chunk it. it. It's called chunk, chunk it. it. When we use chunk it, we break the wall. The wall. We break the, the word the into smaller words to help us read the whole word. You use a part of the word to help you read the whole word. Good. Somebody looking for friends to use chunk it when they get to a tricky word. While we're reading Beanie and the Missing Bear, we're thinking about character thinking on what? Character thinking. Character thinking, ready, go. Character thinking, what the characters are saying inside their heads. When we're trying to figure out what the characters are saying inside their heads, you want to ask yourselves three questions. Get ready to read. The first question, go. How do they feel? The second question. What do they say? And the last question. What do they do? After we ask ourselves those questions, we act like a character and think what they are. Watch yourself, you all right? When I say go, go ahead and take out Beanie and the Missing Bear. Go. Put it on top. When I say go, you're going to start to be to yourself. But wait. When we're reading this time, remember, our mouths can move, but no sounds come out. Because now that we're stronger readers, we have to be thinking as we're reading. So we read to our brains. We read to our brains. So I don't want to hear it. Tell me more. He doesn't feel good about himself because he's getting teased. 